Hi guys, thank you for joining my channel. My name is Lady Envy and this is Envy Envelope's channel. Um, happy to have you guys back. In my channel, we do sinking funds, cash stuffing, a few challenges. Occasional, we'll talk about some life events, you know, real things that are going on in the world. But if any of this sounds interesting to you, uh, make sure you like, you comment, you share, and make sure you smash that bell notification so every time I upload a new video, you will get a notification. Again, thank you for joining. I hope everybody had a great day. Um, I have to say that mine was very eventful, a lot of running around, a lot of errands. Um, but today, I'm going to be uh, cash stuffing a portion of my May 19th uh, uh, paycheck. I get paid bi-weekly. Unfortunately, I can't stuff everything because we're already a few days into June. And I have automated payments that go off straight from the bank to certain bills. So we're just going to stuff today $570. But before we do, guys, I was going through my binders. And um, I'm going to pull the fun one. This is the celebration. This is um, celebrating people like individually for their birthdays, bridals, baby showers. Fun is more like holidays or if not holidays, um, barbecue or family events. And I forgot to mention to you guys, um, I was saving a little bit for Mother's Day. I know it's Mother's Day that you be catering to you. But I'm used to kind of doing everything on my own. Um, whether it's going out, making sure I have enough money, if the girls uh, want to do brunch along with the children. Um, but to my surprise, I had saved a to total of $60 starting from March. I had put a 20 in March, a 40 in early April, a 6, uh, I'm sorry, I apologize. A 20 in March, a 20 in April, a 20 in May, which amounted to $60. Um, and to my surprise... I, on the last uh, minute on Saturday before Mother's Day, um, I was surprised that uh, I was given a call and said, hey, um, we didn't want to tell you before, but if you didn't make plans tomorrow, which most likely you did, it's usually the same crowd, right? Your family, your friends. Uh, but every year you go out of the way for Mother's Day. So this year they decided to surprise me with other mothers and family members and our children. And instead, they brought me along for a brunch. So I didn't have to come out of pocket. However, I was very grateful. And towards the end of the brunch, um, I offered a round of drinks to everybody, at least to the adults, of course. And, you know, no one wanted. Um, one one of my relatives did get one. So did I, which amounted to $16. It was $8 each drink. Um, despite that I only paid the drinks, when we paid the whole bill, we took care of the uh, tip at that moment. Um, but... Only $16 came out. So right now, I have $44 that are from Mother's Day that I'm going to roll over. I don't know what I'm going to roll over now yet. But I am going to roll over in the meantime. Let me just count it. 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. Let's put that to the side in the tray. One, two, three, four. We got forty-four dollars rollover from Mother's Day, Father's Day. I think I'm going to add twenty to that one. Let's see. Today is the okay. And this is coming from a rollover. I'm going to add 20 to this one, which is going to bring us to a total of 80 for Father's Day that is coming up. It should be a total of 80. Let's see. 1, 2, that's 40, 50, 60, 80. Okay. We got 60, 70, 80. We have 80. Up. 
partially from a rollover for Father's Day, even though I have a budget for every paycheck a few months before the holiday comes. And I think I am done with this unstuffing. Um, but now I'm going to leave this to the side for now. Let me take this to the side and we'll roll it over later. Uh, but right now, for currently for my 519 or May 19th a paycheck, I am uh, rolling or I am cash stuffing $570. Uh, one, two, three, four. That's 400. One, two, three, four, five. We got another hundred here. And then we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And then we have one, two, three, four, five in twos, which is ten dollars. Okay, guys, five hundred and seventy dollars. Let me fix this. I like to keep them nice in the same order. I'm sure many of you do too. going to go and oh Jesus everything's falling apart from my desk this happens to me only when I do videos isn't that funny so I am going to start with spending binder and I am going to head and I'll add the budget sheets later but I want to put uh, I want to go ahead and add 15 to mom and dad. I already have five from there and I'm going to put here actually from May. I started with five which is in the small binder that I have to carry and it still has the five dollars. And today I'm adding um, another 15, which makes it 20 total. So we got five here. I mean, I'm sorry, we got 15 here. And then five in my small binder, my carrying binder for the street, which is in my purse right now. I'm done with this binder. Guys, I got this binder um out of aliexpress look at how beautiful it is oh my god i'm i'm a butterfly freak anybody who knows me loves that i love love butterflies and on top of that my favorite color is all purple theme so this was perfect it's sturdy it's hard granted it took around four weeks to receive it um but it the weight was worth it it's good quality and it was possibly the most expensive one I found for the same binder versus Temu and versus Etsy. So AliExpress won me on this one. I'm going to go ahead with the sinking fund. Um, and we are going to go ahead and stuff. And ladies J, we're going to stuff a 20 there. I'm going to take one, two, three, four. $20 and I'm going to head and stuff uh, I'll do the budget the budget sheet later I only did the other one because I didn't do it and I didn't want you to forget it for the mom and dad um, for cart maintenance I'm going to throw an 825 in there sometime soon I'm going to be needing a 20 and a 5. I'm going to be needing a oil change. And 
and I think I want to get my car washed. I haven't washed it all winter to spring and we're about to hit summer. On June 21st will be summer officially here. Cart maintenance. Then I need to file my taxes. Yes, guys, I haven't filed my taxes and I wouldn't recommend anybody to do it. I'm not a uh, certified um, accountant, but I always get a uh, tax refund and working along with uh, IRS um, in the finance industry. I don't work with them, uh, for them. I work along with them for correct reporting in the finance industry. So one of the things that I do know is that as long as you get a refund, you don't really have to file by April 15. You can file at least up to three years. But I wouldn't recommend anybody to do that just because I wouldn't want anyone to be in a position that if they owe the government and you missed that April 15, I think this year was April 18, deadline, then it can be an issue for that. But me personally, because I do get a refund all the time, I'm safe to say that I can go ahead and pay mine anytime for the next three years. Go. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put 100 in my tax filing. So I'll be ready for my accountant. And then I have... Um, We have no back to school. Lady J's College. I have some in the bank, but I'm going to start using this binder, this envelope for it. Uh, I'm going to put away $25 for that. And then, of course, for Sweet 16, I'm also going to throw in a $25 in there. We have a couple of, not a couple, more than a couple of years, but we all know that Sweet uh, 16 is just as expensive as a wedding. Um, her dress, um, her friend that will uh, walk with her, then her little friends that will be the... Um, companionships doing the dance it's kind of like a wedding so i have to start um a few years before um i am going to go into property closing guys i received a friendly gift a shout out for 50 bucks i don't know if i mentioned it last time but it's here since uh may 14th um so property closing is going to get $200, one, $200, $200, and property, property, man, this is intentional. I think in my last video or two videos ago, I mentioned that intentionally every month I save $150 for property, but when I do my rollovers, or this leftover money, um, or if I work overtime or my side hustle, I do throw the extras in the property savings. It's not just the uh, uh, intentional 150, but anything that's that's uh, leftover rollover. So I'm gonna go 120, 140, and 150 into the property savings. Let me put this in the front. And okay, so they're not in order. Okay. They are now. Okay. I'm gonna add these 20 and these five in the back. Did I just make a mistake? Hmm. This should go into the property saving. So I have to take those a hundred. Let me put it back, guys. I'm sorry, I totally apologize. A hundred and forty and fifty. 
I'll put this back into where it goes, which is property clothing. Oh, I'm glad I caught that. I would go nuts. Totally nuts. Let me throw that back in there. Okay, so now, yes, property savings. This is the intentional 150 and anything that's a leftover or overtime or side hustle or rollover, I throw into a property. So it's 100, 20, 40, and 50. So here it goes. So I'm going to put the 100 here. I'm going to put these 20s here. And we're going to put the 5s in the back. Yes. And last but not least, guys. Last but not least. Yes, I need a hair. Accessory to hold this one closed. I got my challenge book right here, or binder. So I have the one dollar and the two dollars, which actually I don't have a sheet for that. I'm gonna add it right now. Here it goes. Is it under the two? Yes. So guys, let me tell you. I haven't done the soap, but in April 27, I took out $10 in $2 bills, which I have not stuffed yet. Now, my intentions of these $2 technically is not actually to spend. It's more of a collectible. Um, more for my daughter. I got two Bs. I got three Bs, actually. Look at that one. Now, G and I. So I got one, two, three, four, five, which is ten dollars, and that was on four twenty-seven. That was a plus ten, and I have a ten total. Let me go ahead and stuff this. Again, this is not really forced to save in the intention of using it for a car or a house or anything. It's really more like a collectible, which I want to pass over to my daughter that's only 11 years old. And when she's older, who knows, maybe when she's 40, 50, 60, may want to hand it to her grandchildren. Or she can keep it and see if there's any value to them. Um, and this one was part of the 570 um may 19 paycheck i took ten dollars as well again for um same purposes i got an l an l another g a b and an i so this is one two three four five ten dollars and today is another ten Brings it to a total of 20. What I am going to do, I'm going to put them by order of letter. Uh, here's a B. Here's the G. Here's the I. And L and L. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, which is twenty dollars and two dollar bills, guys. If you, they're very, very difficult to uh, find here. I had to jump from bank to bank to get them, but I also know that some cash stuff was out there. Um, it's very easy for you guys to find them and locate them. If you'll be so kind to um, send me for my collection, it will be grateful. You will find on my description where my friends mail address where you can send me um maybe a two dollar um bill just because they're very difficult to find here and in different letters as well b d g i l it doesn't matter 
um, as long as I start to collect them. I think this was a great, um, a great uh, challenge that I started. I didn't think I would do it to a dollar, but it's interesting to me. So, guys, um, that today right now is the end of my cash stuffing for today. Um, sometime soon, I will be returning to the bank um, and making a trip so I can start uh, working on my most recent paycheck, which is June 2nd. And that should be coming up sometime soon. Thank you so much, guys, again for joining. Again, don't forget to like, comment, um, share, and subscribe. Uh, make sure you hit that notification bell so every time I upload a new video, you'll get notified. And like I always say, I always love to leave a, my favorite positive phrase, which is keep pushing, keep striving, because there's only one way to go, and that is up, up, up. See you next time, guys.